Episode three is for, about strategic management. It involves a strate- strategic management process. And the first step of that strategic management process is to set the direction. There are many sub steps of setting the direction. They are they consist of establishing an organization directive, formulating a strategy, plan and implementing that strategy, monitoring the results and adjusting as necessary, depending on whether it's going good or well or bad. <clears throat> Now, let's think about this. If two men and a truck is made available in Mexico, we will have a larger profit within this moving company. I think that's a wonderful idea. I need a large profit, and you guys need a large profit too. Zeke wants to achieve the most profit possible. His main objective is to achieve the profit maximization. He wants to use competitive advantage, which would establish a dominant position within moving companies to make sure he's on top. I care about the consumers. How the citizens of Mexico feel with an American moving company paying their people less to provide the Americans with a larger profit. Jim would use the strategic vision for the situation. That he uses the long-term view for the company. He would analyze the numbers to see how the company can improve and grow for future methods. I'm thinking of the consumers and employees as well. Think of the profit both countries will endure. The companies of two men in a truck will make a paycheck to bring their families, while the American company will grow substantially. Greg, in this situation, is most worried about the profit shared to the employees and their families. He would use the SWOT analysis, which is strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, and threats. He would use this method to forecast any decision-making, how they can prove it in the future, and cut out any weaknesses.